Wiring a two-wire AC sensor is not a complicated task. However, if done incorrectly, the switch will be damaged, which can be very costly. In this video, we will be showing you how to wire an IFM two-wire AC capacitive sensor, but the same principle applies for any two-wire AC sensor. As seen here, a sensor connected directly to the power supply without a load is incorrectly wired. When the sensor is tripped, the circuitry in the sensor will overload and the sensor will no longer function. A load must be used for proper function of the sensor. It is important to note that an incandescent light bulb should not be used as a load because the current inrush from a cold bulb can cause an overload condition. The unit we will be wiring is a KI0202, and you can see by the wiring diagram that a fuse is used for protecting the sensor. To correctly wire the AC sensor, we will need the sensor, a power supply, a relay which will be used as the load, a fuse and a fuse terminal, some spare wires, and appropriate screwdrivers. The fuse should be on the hot side of the sensor, therefore the wiring will be from the L terminal, live or hot, of the power supply to the fuse. Next, the fuse is connected to the brown wire of the sensor. Then the blue wire of the sensor will go to the relay, and then the relay will go back to the N terminal, neutral, of the power supply to complete the circuit. It is important to make sure that you are connecting to power on the coil side of the relay. To begin, we insert a wire into one side of the fuse terminal and the brown wire of the sensor into the other side of the fuse terminal. We will connect to the power supply last. Next, the blue wire of the sensor is connected to the coil side of the relay. and another wire is connected to the adjacent terminal of the relay. In this example, the relay will be used as a load and will display the output of the sensor by the LED on the top of the relay. Also, you will hear the click of the contacts in the relay. Make sure the power supply is off before connecting the wires to the power supply terminals. Remove the plastic cover that protects the terminals. Then insert the wires into the proper terminals and make sure the wires are secure. The wire from the fuse is attached to the hot terminal of the power supply, L, and the wire from the relay will be connected to the neutral terminal, N, of the power supply. Insert the fuse into the fuse terminal to verify that a good contact is being made in order to protect the sensor. Test the connections by turning on the power supply. As I place my hand in front of the capacitive sensor, I can see the LED on the relay as well as hear the click of the relay cycling. Thank you for allowing IFM to teach you how to properly wire a two-wire AC sensor.